Ooh, hello there, my fellow miners and crafters. Good times. So Oscar here, bringing you a brand new creative house building series where we're going to build this beautiful modern house in front of you, codenamed the Small House. So, as if you're as excited as I am to get this new series underway, definitely hit that like button and let's get this series underway. All right, and welcome back to our creative house building series. It's been way too long, and here is our land where we are going to build our house. It'll be super awesome to come back at the end of the project and look at this video with it all blank and bland and ready for a beautiful house. So of course we are just adjacent to our prior modern house just around the hill there looking super fancy back there. But let's take a look at some of our materials that we will be using for the build. So of course the house is codenamed S'more House. So we are using our dark chocolate, our milk chocolate, and our quartz acting as a marshmallow of course. And I think it'll look pretty good. I think this will be pretty awesome. So of course these are our main structural blocks across here. And of course glass for windows and doors and then some structural blocks for our hardened clay. Now, just over here are some of the accent colors that will be for furniture and different things throughout the house, just to add a little bit of color. Now, this area through here is our landscaping materials. Landscaping is going to be pretty blank and kind of, you know, very modern, very kind of a sterile design. And I think that'll look pretty darn awesome. Now, let's fly on over here. And of course, we've got jelly and the milkshake maker all ready to go for one super awesome modern house. All right, so let's fly over here and grab ourselves just a few materials. There we go. Looking good. Now, what we're going to be doing here is we're going to be setting up right here. So we're going to be starting right here. Now, if you guys want to build with me, you can. I will have the world available for download down in the description. I'd love it if you guys built this along with me. You can build it in your own world, but it would be super awesome if you built it within this world and take a picture of yourself, you know, a screenshot of you building it, send it to me on Twitter. I'll retweet the uh, the first ones I get as the video goes live. And I think that'll be super awesome. So I really want this to be a collaborative effort between us as we kind of build this. We're all building it together. I think we be super awesome so we're gonna place this so this is the ground right here and we're gonna go two blocks above the ground and place our first block right there now the reason being is it gives us room for enhancements down the road for landscaping and different things like that so first blocks placed now we're going to count this out so that's two three four five six seven eight 9, 10, 11. Beautiful. And then once again, we'll bring out this section. And this is, again, 11 blocks. So this is 11 by 11. Beautiful. Awesome. So now what we're going to do is we're going to switch over to our spruce planks. And I'm actually going to remove that block and replace it with a spruce block. Now from that spruce block, we're going to go 30 blocks this way. Okay. So we're going to bring this all the way out to here. And there we go. Awesome. So we just went 30 blocks. So from here, all the way down there is 30 blocks. Now from this block, right here so we're right there we're gonna bring this piece oh the way whoops oh we goofed up first scar mistake of the series first scar mistake anyway this block right there is 11 okay now from this one right here we're gonna bring this out 14 there we go looking good and this is a creative world so I can turn that rain off without a second thought <laughs> wonderful so right here from this block we're gonna go about 29 I believe so we're gonna bring this down to about 29 there we go awesome wonderful and then we're gonna bring this one all the way till it lines up so what you'll do is you'll just bring this all the way up to here so let's line it up with that dark chocolate block just yonder over there wonderful so you just line it up perfect with that one awesome well there we go so Whenever we start out a series, we always want to take the time to lay it out, get the dimensions perfect so that uh, once we're, you know, building and adding all the structural, you know, walls and roofs and stuff, everything is always perfectly lined up and ready to go. All right, so I took one second there to lay out a little bit of dirt to kind of give us something to put our blocks upon. And now let's fly on over here. So what we're going to do is where we kind of started. So this is our first block that we started. Now what we're going to do is we're going to grab out our quartz and we're going to go boom, bada bam, like so. And then we're going to space that out by three. So we're going to move over to there and then do another one right there. And now we're going to go one. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six. So we're going to go this all the way up to about six. There we go. Looking good, looking good. So this is kind of, you know, this might look a little odd at first, but uh, but bear with me here because I think this will be pretty cool. Um, the reason we're doing some of this, you know, elevating it up above, we're just trying to make sure we have room for our deck, our landscaping and different things like that. Of course, the dirt will be replaced eventually also. All right, so now what we're gonna do is we're just going to, let's see, I think I'm gonna go right here. So a spacing of there. So I have that little bit of a spacing there. We're gonna grab out our panes and we're gonna run those along the sides. This will act as doorways. There we go, looking good. And now we're going to go up here and we're gonna run a pillar across there. 
and then I think that looks good. I think that looks good. And then I'm gonna run an additional one under here. Now this will look a little bit different once we get a little bit farther in to the design, but for now, this is what it'll look like. There we go. So now we're going to bring this up like we did on the other side, six blocks high. There we go. And then we're going to space this out by one, two, three, four, and then place another one along here. Looking good, looking good. Things are starting to come together. And I'm gonna grab a bit of quartz and I'm gonna run that in the interior along there and then bring that out like so. Awesome. Now, some of this upper level along here may change, but most likely not. All right, there we go. And then run this up to the side. And then what I'm thinking here is we're doing blocks. So these are our stained glass light gray. Um, what are your thoughts on maybe doing this in panes? Which one do you like better, panes or solid blocks? Panes or solid blocks? Hmm, that's the question. Ooh, I kind of like that, that's kind of cool. Um, I don't know, I think I'm gonna do it in solid blocks for now, but let me know in the comments if that should be panes or solid blocks. Okay, good, wonderful. Now we're gonna move on here. So next section over here, I believe we're gonna space this out by three. So one, two, three, there we go. And then I'm gonna go like that. And we're bring this up here once again, like so, and then fill in our marshmallow in the side here. Looking good, awesome. So it would be super awesome if 1.9 would finally come out and allow us to have new blocks for building because last year, of course, when we were working with our underwater house, we were at like the cutting edge of new blocks in Minecraft with all the underwater things and stuff. So hopefully if 1.9 comes out soon and we can incorporate some of those new blocks into our build. So right here, we're gonna go one glass block. So one, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. And then of course we just bring this all the way up looking good looking good now what i'm thinking maybe is i'm going to do is i'm going to remove that top section instead of six we'll just do it five i think that'll look better there we go and then bring that across there and then you guessed it we're going to come over here and put a slab of chocolate going up this way and bring that all the way up to six and then over here let me see how we're doing so one two three four beautiful and then we're just going to take this and we're going to run that all the way up to the top and we are starting to get our facade complete on the house and it is starting to look pretty darn awesome. There we go. It looks bland and boring at this point, but hopefully you got a sense of what the, you know, the final product will look like once we complete it. And yeah, so I'm really excited about this build. I really think it's going to be awesome. So from this dirt block here, we're going to go one, two, three, four. Okay. Looking good, looking good. So this will be our decking. So this will be kind of the deck in front of the house. So this will look pretty cool. Now there's not really enough room in the deck to add chairs and different things like that. You know, like lounge chairs in front of the house or anything along those lines. But I think it will look pretty cool for this design. Now this house I think would look amazing by a beach. Um, so I think if you guys, some of you were to build this maybe next to the ocean or something in Minecraft, oh no, 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 we don't put up with that. Um, that would be amazing if you guys did that, if you were to um, assemble this house in a beach biome, that would be amazing, right on the beach by the sand, ah, oh, I, I would love that. Okay, wonderful, so now what we're gonna do, so we're gonna go up here and we're gonna run this across here, looking good, looking good, and once we finally add, you know, all those details um, to the outside. I think this will look really cool. Okay, and I'm gonna grab that and then we're going to run this across here. So we're gonna run this all the way across here. Looking good, looking good. There we go, bring that across. Awesome. Okay, so now the question is, now the question is, I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna go right here. Okay, I think it's something like that is what I wanna do. So I'm gonna go like that, bring it up to here bring it out like that, and then, do I have a half slab on me? No, I don't, so let me fly over here, grab myself a half slab, fly on back, and then we're just going to place that along here. Yeah, there we go, slowly coming together. So right here is where we're gonna do hedge work and our grass will go along there. So that will cover up so it's not just one large expanse of one block. So yeah, so give me one second, let me kind of catch my breath, and I'll be right back. All right, and welcome back. So a couple of things I would like to try to do is maybe extend this out just a little bit more and then bring that out to about there. We, we'll see, I might add a few other little details here. Let's actually go back over here and let's grab out just a couple extra little doodads. There we go. And do we get a half slab? Yes, we did, awesome. Uh, and then we can go like something like that. Ooh, I like that, I like that quite a bit. And then up here, what I wanna do is I wanna take a half slab and run that across here like so, 
all the way across. And this is just continuing to add layer by layer more detail to the house. Now this section right here will change eventually. We're going to do some little you know, pillars and stuff like that. Now you might've noticed there isn't the garage area yet. Well, we were gonna work on the garage in a little bit, so we're not gonna quite do the garage quite yet. All right, so we're actually gonna grab out our spruce now. And we're gonna go from this block right there. So we're gonna leave out that one there and we're gonna go. So that's one, two, three, four, beautiful. And now we're gonna run that all the way up to the top here, as you can see. Actually, we're gonna cut that one out. There we go, and that's five blocks. So from here, one, two, three, four, five. Take this block here, and then we're gonna bring that all the way across here. If I can click it, there we go, there we go. And I'm just gonna do this as a temporary block. There we go, just to line that up, beautiful. So we're gonna run this all the way across. So this goes all the way across, and then just for temporary measure, I'm just gonna run that up to there. Beautiful, so that lines it up, awesome. All right, looking good. So right here, so at this block right here, we're going to go one, two, three, four, okay? I think that'll be good, I think that'll be good, okay? And now we're going to get a block. Let me sample that block, there we go. So we're gonna now run this across here. So this will act as kind of a living room or a family room in this area of the house. So we'll be able to do some fancy couches and different things like that. So let me know as we're kind of going along here and finishing up the final details, um, what your thoughts are on some things we could do for the interior. What are some, you know, furniture things or rooms or different things like that you guys would like to see within this house? Now, I got one plan. I've got I've got a couple plans for some rooms. Uh, one of them would be a Twitch streaming room. I think that would be amazing. I'm really looking forward to building something like that uh, in the house. So having something like a, you know, a Twitch streaming room where we could get real creative with some fun details and different things like that. Um, yeah, I think that'd be really fun to do. Okay, so we're going to take some uh, stairs. We're just going to run those along there like so. There we go. Now there's one rogue block back there. We gotta sneak back here and click. There we go, looking good. And then we'll bring that across here. Looking good, looking good. And then to right here, I'm gonna stop right here because there's more detail we're gonna do in this span of that room a little bit later. A little bit later, this area will change a little bit. So we're not gonna get too technical with that, okay? And then I don't have it on me, so let me fly back over here, grab that, come on. There we go, looking good. And then what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna run this one on top of those. There we go, and cut that off, and there we go. Slowly looking good, slowly looking good. There we go, well I'm absolutely loving this so far, and hopefully you guys are too, and you're inspired to build this along with me. And yeah, like I said, definitely take some screenshots and uh, post them on my Twitter, and I'd love to retweet them and just kind of uh, share the experience with you guys as we build this amazing house. So let's just do a quick recap of things we've built so we can kind of do a little fly over here and you can kind of make sure you get all the little details and different things like that. Now, I would like to actually bring this all the way up. So let me actually do that now. There we go, awesome. Wonderful, so that just kind of connects it together. There we go, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching and hopefully you were inspired video and the next part will be out very soon. And until next time, this has been Good Times with Scar. And I always really appreciate you guys taking the time to watch my videos. And if you believe the video deserved a rating, that would be much appreciated. And until next time, we'll see you later. And don't forget to follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Kind of using that Viking style as an inspiration for our ship that will be crushed by a sea monster eventually. And then that will make it so then you, you know, go into the underground sections and all that good stuff that we've been talking about. And yeah, it is super amazing to finally have all the